are you doing today? We are going to make a great tasty and healthy and crunchy snack and it's made from chickpeas. Alright, this is so easy. What I've done is first we'll go over the ingredients. I have a can of chickpeas. They're organic chickpeas. Salt. Smoked, smoked paprika. It smells delicious. And some olive oil and some garlic just in case we want to add garlic to it. I've preheated my oven to 350 and what we're going to do is we're going to strain these chickpeas. Oop, there goes the cap. <laughs> we might want to take that out. All right. Chickpeas are delicious. Um, they're full of fiber. They're really a great healthy snack. I love to put them on top of salads. You can put them on top of chicken dishes. There are so many things you can do with them. They're also called chichi beans. We're just going to put the, that over there and watch this. I'm just going to take them and I have a towel here. And we're, what we want to do is just kind of dry them off a little bit, okay? So I'm going to dry them. To roll them back and forth. You could do this in a paper towel. Just dry them off a little so they're not soaking wet. Okay, there, they're looking good. You don't want to push too hard because then you're going to squash them off. So now we're going to take them and we're going to put them in a bowl. And you know what? I wanted to talk to you about being aware of reading your labels, especially when you're buying canned foods because canned foods are lined with BPA. It's a chemical to keep the food fresh inside and it's a hormone disruptor. It will mess with your body. So really be careful, read your labels, be aware of what you're putting into your body and you do not want to be ingesting cans using BPA. And you can read more about that. Okay, so we've got our chickpeas. What we're going to do now is we're going to take about a tablespoon of olive oil. I'm, I'm eyeballing it today, all right? We're going to mix that up. So easy. I'm going to take a little salt. This is Celtic sea salt. I'm going to twist that in there. And then we're going to take our smoked paprika. I wish you could smell this. It's sweet smoked paprika. It's going to give it a nice hint of a smoky flavor, but it's a natural spice. It's red. It's going to give those chickpeas some color. I'm going to put a whole bunch of it on. All right. And if you want, you can put on some garlic, some fresh pressed garlic. I'm not going to do that today because my garlic press is over there, but you could just press some garlic in and it's going to be delicious. I'm going to mix them up. Next, we're going to take, I wanted to show you this. This is um, parchment paper that, hold on. Okay, we're going to add just a little bit of garlic. I have my garlic press now. So, whoop, I put it in there. Get that workout in. Squeeze it, squeeze it, squeeze it. Get off any extra and just mix it around. They're going to be garlicky and smoky. Okay, now I wanted to show you this. This is a nonstick pan liner. It's not open. Let's open it up. And what's great about this is it's aluminum foil on one side and parchment paper on the other. So this way you can cook, you can bake without something sticking to your pan, but also you're not cooking on top of aluminum. So I'm going to use this. How well trouble here today. All right. What is it going to get today? <laughs> All right. So we're going to take our chickpeas and we're going to spread them out. I'm just going to pour them all out. You want to spread them out nice and evenly if you can. And then we are going to pop these babies in the oven. We're going to cook them for about 45, 50 minutes until they're crunchy. All right. We're going to put them, I say all right a lot, don't I? We're going to put them in the oven. In a little rack. I'm going to set my timer. 50 minutes. 
and I'll check back with you when they're done. Okay, the timer went off, the chickpeas are ready, so we're gonna take them out of the oven. It's been 50 minutes now. I wanna tell you, halfway through, I just kind of shook the tray a little bit just to move all the chickpeas around. All right, here we go. Here they are, they're so cute. I don't know if you can see them. Wait a minute, the paper's in the way. There they are. They shrunk down, they're probably really hot, they're crispy. And what we want to do is just let them sit here for about an hour to cool off, and then you can munch on them. These are a great snack for your afternoon when you're not quite sure what to eat, but you want something crunchy. Let's see. They're good to eat now. Mm, really good. Really delicious. And enjoy them. So easy to make, so easy to do, and you can put any kind of flavoring on them that you like. So eat healthy and enjoy. Bye-bye. I'll see you in another video.